Let's cross now to Arthur with all that action. Welcome to the Olympic Village here in Heidelberg and a big clash here with the Heidelberg Warriors and South Melbourne FC. One of the traditional big clashes of the Foxtel Cup Premier League calendar and a very, very important clash. The lineup for today, the Heidelberg Warriors team. Number one, Pashi Schwagler. Number five, Robert Roddy. Number three, Daniel Jones. Number 21, Erhan Karhan. Number seven, Jim Drossos. Number four, Tony Ulyaris. Number 20, Nick Sabuljak. Number 19, George Kutsoulis. Number nine, Luca Glavas. Number 10, Nick Marinos. And number 11, Andy Vlahos. South Melbourne lineup for today. Number one, Michael Langerak. Number three, Sam DeVito. Number seven, Trent Waterson. Number eight, Adam Van Bommel. Number nine, Nathan Caldwell. Number 10, Vasilios Natsoulas. Number 11, Ricky Diaco. Number 14, Ramat Avzanoglu. Number 16, Tanzul Beza. Number 18, Yusuf Yusuf and 21, Joseph Vasquez. As the Warriors in their traditional all yellow strip. Kicking to the goal, left of screen, a good cross there, the header. Still a chance there, but cleared away. Only as far as... It was uh, the youngster there in uh, Glavis, I think it was. Yes, it was. And it's a corner ball for the Warriors. Throw forward now. Vlahos on the ball. Van Dommel on the ball. The chance for a header there. And still in play. Great goal. 1-0 to Marinos. And what a way to start the game there for the Warriors. Langerak got a hand on it, but you'd have to question the marking there of the South Melbourne defence. Great start there for the Warriors. Four minutes in, one goal to nil. Tulas loses the ball again. Some good work there to try and get the ball forward there by Drossos. And a chance again here for Lavas. Arenos maybe tried a little bit too much there. Should have done the simple thing. He would have had another chance on goal there. Glavas. Useful ball that for Sabuljak. Marinos. Langerex pumped it away. A chance here again. It's in. Drossos has scored. And Heidelberg Warriors are two up in the space of seven and a half minutes here. Two nil up. Langerex palmed the ball into the path of Drossos and Drossos has buried it and made it 2-0 to the Warriors. Waterson on uh, the ball now. A deep uh, cross there. The keeper's come and the ball cleared away. Only just Yusuf Caldwell. The ball headed away and... Uh, Pazzi Schwagler at sea there. Very lucky not to have conceded a goal there. Diaco and a chance for South Melbourne. Cleared away for a corner. And Pazzi Schwagler just about almost made a mess of it again. He's really had an indifferent game as of... Uh, late and really his form hasn't been what we know it can be and cleared over the bar only just there ball across there for Waterson still Waterson still Waterson uh, just over the bar there maybe should have gone wide to the loose man in Tiago but it was a useful effort and it's half time here at uh, the Olympic Village. And the Heidelberg Warriors really doing it comfortably at the moment. Two goals to nil. The 
minutes or less. Goes wide to Beza. Good ball into the box. The header. And Schwagler easily mopping up there. Regulation goalkeeping there. Caldwell did well. But Amazon, it's three on two. Can they punish? No, they can't. Very ordinary ball that. And really should have made a lot better leeway with that ball. And now the Warriors go forward. Marinos. Get a shot on goal here. And a chance now. Oh, yes! Oh, it's hit the post. And what a chance there for Marinos. Langerak beaten right across the face of goal. And Langerak palms it out for a corner, not knowing if there was a man behind him. Diaco. The referee allows play on on a very solid challenge. And a chance now for Erdhan Karthan. Can he make it three? No. And a miss there for the Warriors. Should have been 3-0. The referee allowed play on. And Erdhan Karthan beat the offside trap. Missed an open goal there. Time ticking away here for South Melbourne. And a chance now. Right into the arms of Langerak. And DeVito really shocking defending there. Really had an ordinary game today. Marinos. And a great ball in there. Drossos! Oh, my Lord. Through Langerak. And Marinos, sensational stuff there. And really, that is definitely curtains for South Melbourne. Great finish, and Langerak really unsighted there. I thought maybe saw it late and basically went under him. Waterson. Called well, and shot there against the hand, but no real claims for a handball. It would have been unjust had it been so. Katsoulis. Ulyaris. Great ball by Ulyaris. And just wide there by Marinos. Really... Super ball that, and it definitely wasn't offside. And Marinos really should have had his second. Diaco to Yusuf. Maybe a little bit too wide. Into the box. Caldwell. And it's a goal kick. No real danger for Schwagler there. And it's all over here at Olympic Village with a thumping win here for Warriors. The Foxtel Cup champions really made to look second right here against a Warriors team that really had a sensational victory here. Two early goals really set the scene for the home side. And a third, and really, there could have been four and five, really, if they had taken their chances. I've got the successful coach here with me, George Katsakis. Great victory. And really, uh, against uh, last year's champions, 3-0 win, sensational stuff. It's, uh, it's an emphatic win, Arch. Uh, it's good to be back at home and uh, under the circumstances that we had today in front of a great crowd, uh, the local derby, and not, not forgetting the roots of football where they've come from. And... Uh, like you said, it was just a, a, a great display of the boys. Uh, they worked very hard during the week. We sat down and uh, analysed last week's uh, performance, which was fairly poor. Uh, we managed to get back on track today successfully. Hopefully this is the start.